of Funny Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. And today's mom and Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for the God of High School chapter 562. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored, if you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more anime, manga, and mama content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our cash up and PayPal links are in the description box below. So, okay. So, I do like what we're getting to an extent up in here. I like that everyone is surrendering um, their borrowed power um, give, doing like a really vast like spirit bomb kind of thing, especially since they realized, um, well, you know, they found out that they were given their bar um, borrowed power and everything was based on a lie. So it's like, dude, this is fucked up. We don't deserve this shit. And we can use, um, we can use this to save ourselves, especially since this motherfucker wants to kill us anyway. So why not? But the thing that's really pissing me off is, where's my baby? Where's my Lucifer? Yeah, I know I saw Satan there, but, th but that's Satan. He, remember, remember with Satan, he, um, he is reclaiming his name as Lucifer. So seeing Satan there, don't bother me. Because it's like, okay, Satan gave away his wings, gave his, his spirit being there, don't bother me. Because he's gone. But I'm going to see Lucifer. Give me him. I'm going to see him and um, Mori Jin take down, um, uh, take down Mu Jin. Like, that to me just makes the most sense. It feels like it was leading to this. If I don't see it, if I don't see my baby, I'm going to be so mad. You have no idea. But anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. Thanks for everything. Take care. And reach. See, this is bad at Dragon Ball. You made us happy. Blue Giant 99.99% crossed over. Again, where is Mount Lucifer? He needs to be here. Oh, look at those wings. Holy shit. Oh, my God. The power that a god lends to humans borrow power. Dude, look at that shit. Oh, my God. Look at that Yowie. That Yowie is fucking sexy. Look at that. A spirit bomb could never look that good. Spirit bomb could never. Never. You really didn't learn it, huh? Borrowed power. You didn't learn it from a a, um, a commissioner. No, I didn't. Now, now that I see it for myself, it doesn't look that powerful. What did I tell you, Wukong? People and demons both have Buddha within them. Aw, you were right, uh, Zwan Zhang. Everyone, everyone's feelings are the strongest. The first and last power lent to a god by humans, Nirvana. <gasps> what? God, dear God, is it God? Is it Tathagata? No, it's Mori Jin, the same one who helped us and we helped. He's just our knucklehead friend. Aww. <gasps> oh my God. I think I just found my thumbnail. Holy shit. Look, this background is everything. Look at, this is as Mori's lifting the, um, the yaoi, the shadowing. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. Oh my god. Oh, move on, I'm not liking this, but god, this is everything. The wings don't look as sexy here, but, mm. but that, dude, that yaoi looks so beautiful. Oh my god, this background. Oh my god, this background is so sexy. Holy shit. Oh my god. I'm sad this mama was end uh, I'm sad this mom was ending. I really am. There once was a god. Born as a human, he was betrayed by the gods and tried to bring them down until one day he became a god himself. The irony. There once was a god, the strongest god of them all. Like the other god, he too was betrayed by the gods and fell to earth when, uh, where he became a human. Weaker than he had ever been before, and carrying the weight of the world in his shoulders, the god began to silently walk forward. Meme, oh, oh. oh. 
Oh my God. Meanwhile, the human who was determined to bring down the gods chose the path that would leave him friendless for the sake of his goal. Look at the skeletons on top of Wujin. Uh, Look at that background. Look at the, oh gosh. Oh, I wish the, the skeletons are a little too bright though. It could be a little bit darker like the ones on the ground. An extraordinary origin story. Overflowing potential. And, oh God, this is so amazing. An insurmountable uh, wall and the first taste of despair. Ooh, the, yeah, there's the Tatha God. Yeah, and Moi's grandpa. I know. The parallels are so interesting, aren't they? How their stories, it's like yin and yang, isn't it? I hope if this if this mama says that it's yin and yang, I'm going to fucking die. Because that's what this is. It really goddamn is a yin yang motif. Oh my god, my cat is so goddamn cute. Oh my god. I'm gonna put the camera on him because he looks really goddamn cute. I'm so tempted. Oh my god, he's so cute. Kitty, why do you have to be cute right now? Um, the two gods meant a friend, a teacher, or some would say a prophet. And a formed a relationship with them. Mm-hmm. Only to be betrayed and hurt by a god who wanted the prophet's power. Yep. Tathagata and Beelzebub. Mm -hmm. They were left with different last words. Trust humans. I hate humans. The yin yang motif is everything. Make lots of friends. I hate humans and despise the gods. Mm -hmm. They met different people and took different paths. Then, I love this. I fucking love this. Their paths crossed. The one who had once been the strongest god became a human and made many friends who helped to carry his cross. While the other one who had been born a human and became a god left behind everything and was alone. This red background's fucking everything. The two gods that were alike and yet not alike crossed paths. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, this is so sexy. Oh my god, this is. Oh my god. Oh, the wings look so gorgeous. They are like three-dimensional. They are so beautiful. And then you've got this background that's like a work of art. My god. Oh my god. And then there's the clash. And fought like mad. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Now the wings don't look cool no more. They did from afar, but it's okay. This clash looks bomb. Where is my man's? Where is he? Am I not? Am I just not gonna get Lucifer? Don't pray to him. You're the ones who gave him this power. Don't kneel. He's just a god that you made up. The blue giant was destroyed, and the solar system's gravitational field is already a mess. Disappear along with the solar system, Mori Jin. Again, where's my where's my man? Where is he? Ooh. Hmm? Did time just stop? <gasps> Woo! Go back to where you came from. Yo! He's able to completely defy the order of things? Holy shit! This is Trinity 7 levels of fuckery. It is. Oh, let's be real. It's been Trinity 7 levels of fuckery. But goddamn, this is gorgeous. Oh, his color palette is everything. But where's, where's my baby? Where's Lucifer? Ooh, and there it goes. He even has the power to create and regenerate? Oh my god, this is really giving me, um... Giving me Shinra and Fire Force, but on a larger scale. But yeah, this really does give me that. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Oh my god, this is. But yeah, this is very, very, very much like Shinra. Just, again, just with Shinra, it was on a planet. It was just, you know, Earth. But here, it's on a universal scale, which I think is really cool. I'm glad it's like that. Because um, Shinra... Well, we don't know what the fuck Shinra was. Well, I'm still fucking mad about that. God damn it, Okobo. I hate that you fucking did that. I hate that you just wouldn't say that, um, the first, uh, the, um, the Lord of the, uh, um, oh my God. 
What's the word I'm looking for? Shit. I wish it would have just said, like, um, the, um, god damn it, it's gonna drive me fucking nuts. I can't remember the name off the top of my head. What is that? The Adola, that's what it was. The, the Lord of Adola. Well, why couldn't you just say Burn slash the Lord of Adola was, um, Shimra and Sho's father? Was it that really fucking hard? <laughs> Because that's what it really is. I didn't like the virginal birth shit. It just is like, what the fuck? You couldn't just say that? Like, come on, man. That really pissed me off. I fucking hated that shit in Fire Force. I was not happy with that. But anyways. God damn it, this is, this is fucking Fire Force. This is what Shimmer did, but on a universal scale. I will not get over it. And being with, um... Uh, a being with power over nature. Again, Shimmer did this too. Karma, but... Oh, it's a weak finish. Ooh. What are you doing? Ooh, what? That hurt. Whoa. This is the real deal. Lord of God, oh, we devote ourselves to you. I'm reminded of the first time I felt despair, except it's from his grandson this time. Uh, where is Lucifer? Where is he? I'm really mad. Meanwhile, my kitty is like in like super dream mode. Oh my God, he's so cut and cute. I feel it even more strongly than back then. Oh, he's freaking out. I devote myself to you. Tathagata gets it. I want to kneel and worship him. I want to put my hands together and pray. Shut up! Ye disappear. I'm fading away. What? No. Hmm? <sighs> he rejected my karma? Red, wing, red wings, I see. You too have someone who's precious to you. What's this? Hmm. It's warm. Those wings are rejecting the power of my karma. Right, Mujin Park, you too might be. My body has already reached its limit. Oof. My body won't stop uh, disintegrating. You should give up. There will be no coming back from this. Hmm. Eighth letter, the blade of Tathagata. I see. Did you come to me because Miryu used up all her energy? Ooh. When I was young, I felt like I had. I felt like the world was in the palm of my hand. Are you telling me to keep moving forward? God, Buddha, or the God, God of Gods who cares? Oh, shit! Lucifer, if you do not get your ass up here, I will be so pissed. Killing off all of the gods is my duty. Hmm? Yo, what? Rusty Fallen Blade, Broken Blade of uh, Tathagata. This art keeps getting better and fucking better. Oh, my God. One holy spirit, dude. I love this rough art style here. Oh my god, it's so cool. It's like a charcoal kind of art style. Oh my god, this is fucking awesome. Oh, and look at look at um how his body is like. Part of it is like already gone already. Oh, this is bomb. Here I come, Mujin. If if you had someone like uh, Zwan Zang or Grandpa by your side, would things have been different? Well, you kind of did for a minute there with Grandpa, but... Here I come. There were once two gods. Where's Lucifer? The two gods were alike, and yet not alike. They met different people and walked different paths. Then they crossed paths and fought like mad. In the end... Hmm... My left arm is breaking off. Ooh. Thanks, Samsara, for helping me block the Holy Spear. Ooh. A single blow using what remains of my life. 
you've put your life on the line. Um, malice, ooh. The most perfect circle. I know you'll be able to get there. After countless lives, the technique um, was completed. Mori Jin original, extreme version. <gasps> the extreme finishing move. Let's go. Jin. Ooh. Hochuk. Yo. Perfect circle. Oh, we did it. The perfect circle. Where's Lucifer? All of my power is being sucked in. I love how he's dying, but where's where's my baby? Even all of my malice. It's beautiful. Bye, malice. Hmm. He wasn't aiming for me. Was that attack meant to purify the universe? It's all over. Inexhaustible, limitless Mujin Park. I'm Mujin Park. Ooh, she it. Inexhaustible, limitless. The two gods fought like mad in the end. What? They became the world. What? The, what the fuck is this? They became the world. And I don't get loose for... I'm not happy with this. Where's my baby? Like, I'm not happy. Where is he? Like, if I see Lucifer come out of there, I will be stoked. But are we just saying fuck off Lucifer at this point? Like, this is so stupid. There's no reason for this. None. None. There's no reason for Lucifer not to be here. Oh my god, cats. Why? Oh my cat is just awesome right now. There's no reason for this. But I do this art though. Oh god, this art is everything. I love the art style we're getting. The writing, I'm not having a problem with the writing. I just am like, well, for the most part, I'm fine with it. But like, there were so many opportunities you could have Lucifer like rise up and like do something. I'm just. I'm so mad that I'm not seeing him. I wanted to see him and Mori Jin like together doing this. And the fact that he's just like been like thrown aside, it really makes me mad. It feels like, oh, it feels like Fire Force all over again. Shit, you could have had, I don't, you could have had like something similar to, speaking of, similar to Fire Force or like with Arthur where Arthur was just chilling. You could have had something like that with, with Lucifer just chilling and then having him come in and help Mori Jin in the end. If he needed it. I would have been fine with that. But if Lucifer comes out of there, I will be happy. If he doesn't and I just don't see him again, I'm going to be just fucking pissed and hate this. I really will. Because I was looking forward to seeing what Lucifer's, you know, form was going to be. It's some fuckery and some bullshit but this let's be fucking real what this is as a set this is shimra shimra bashaman on a universal scale that's what this is but i will but i will say this this would have been like if hamue um didn't go if this this is like the reverse of hamue and i kind of am happy with that because I kind of, because I didn't get to get the fight against Yona that I wanted. So to have this makes me feel really good. Because I wanted this in Fire Force and getting it here feels good for me. I'm very happy with this. Very, very happy with this. That we got, um, that we got, got this writing. I'm so happy. And it's on a universal scale. I just feel like the only thing missing is Lucifer. If Lucifer would have been here... Especially, like, especially since you have, be you have the shit with Beelzebub in here as well. It's like, dude, it's right there. Motherfucker. It's right there. Why? Why would you not do this? It's so close to being perfect. It just needs Lucifer up in there, and I will be stoked. 
but as I said, this is definitely a better version of Fire um, in terms of like Fire Force. Comparing this to Fire Force, this is definitely better. I'm very happy. It's giving me Fire Force meets Dragon Ball. And I really, really like that. Again, I like that the people gave up their powers. And yes, in Fire Force, you have the same thing um, where they, you know, everyone gave up their powers as well. But it wasn't like this, though where you had everyone give up their powers to help um, uh, Mori Jin uh, say, uh, you know, save the world and become, you know, become a god, a god of gods and save the world. No, it wasn't like that. Um, it, I think this was done, I will say this, I think this is executed better than Fire Force in a lot of respects. But just not having, like, if Lucifer would have been there in the way that um, Arthur, that I wanted Arthur to kind of be there for Shinra, and I didn't, and obviously I couldn't get it, but you know what I mean. If Lucifer would have, would, would have been there, I would have, this would have been perfect for me, and I would have been very, very pleased. Right now, I'm not happy. Oh, hi, kitties. Kitty senses I'm not happy. I can't use smart like that. But I'm curious what you guys think. This art is everything. I'm going to miss this mama just for this art. I really like the parallels that we got with, um, uh, with Mori Jin and Mu Jin. I really like that. I thought that was a nice touch. I like seeing Tathagata bow down to, um, uh, to Mori Jin. I think the only thing, the only other thing I will say that I'm kind of let down by in regards to this is I kind of wanted to see like the perfect fusion um, I wanted, I really did kind of want that. I would have wanted to see like the full thing. I think that was the other thing that is, was lacking because at least with, um, well, no, I think you can make the art give me a fire first. We kind of got that. Right, Keith? But I'm curious what you guys think. I think those were the two things I would say were lacking here is Lucifer and, um, not getting the, like, full complete fusion because they needed the baby for that um and i kind of want to talk the god to take control i understand now i completely understand why Tata god didn't take control I do but i still would have liked to have that perfect i would have wouldn't mind having that perfect fusion with the you know with the baby and with moochin in control i would have been fine with that to be honest but it is what it is uh, just having the getting Mujin exposed as a fucking hypocrite is enough for me in regards to that. But I'm really curious what you guys think. Um, what do you guys think of this, how this fight is going? Um, do you guys agree, especially if you've read Fire Force? Do you guys, are you guys kind of getting like the Fire Force vibes that I am? Um, and also meeting like meeting Dragon Ball kind of things, uh, vibes that I, uh, that I am. And do you think I'm just being biased in regards to Lucifer? Or do you guys agree with me that that's just what this needed for me it was Lucifer. Cause like, why would you have him reclaim his name and not do anything with it? Especially when Lucifer compared himself to Mujin and said he was forsaken. Why would you not do anything with that? That really fucking pisses me off. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerd Against Inc. And if you love what we're doing and want to help, keep this channel alive and kicking so me and Kitty can keep bringing you more God of High School content. A few ways you could do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon, and put something off on Amazon, which is all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.